This is a question I never thought about. This reader is asking, why are brand new ball joints so difficult to move? The simple answer is, is the joints not loaded yet. In other words, it's not on the vehicle. It's not attached to the knuckle. The knuckle is not attached to the ride control component or the spring on the vehicle. This way, it's not fully tensioned. Sure, it has the same amount of tension on it, and it's going to move so it doesn't bind in the suspension, but the driver's not going to experience that. Over time, the ball joint will wear out due to friction going back and forth, and it could fail if the boot right here has a leak and dust, debris, and water get inside, and change the tolerances between the Belleville washer and the cup itself. This way, the ball joint is going to move a whole lot more freely, and this is what you may see coming off of the vehicle. Okay, so back in the day, they used to have what's known as a fish scale test. Some OEMs still have this test in their service information. Basically, what it involves is attaching a fish scale to the knuckle of the vehicle and determining how much force it takes to move it. In some cases, you're also attaching it to the ball joint while it's off the vehicle. Some cases, they're actually using a torque wrench to measure the amount of force required to move the ball joint itself. Typically, when you pull a ball joint off a vehicle, well, it's almost take almost nothing. A new ball joint will have a specification that you're going to have to look up in the repair information. But if you're taking a control arm or ball joint out of the box, it's going to have a certain amount of torque required to move it. And this is perfectly natural for it to feel awful stiff before it goes on the vehicle. This is a sign that it's brand new. The cup and bearing are within specifications. So there's your answer. It's actually normal for this ball joint to feel stiff before it gets installed on the vehicle. But once you install it, well, move the knuckle around to see if there's any memory steer or hard spots to see if it was installed properly. I'm Andrew Markell. Thank you very much.